You know, it's a nice view that we have going on there, but uh, then some rain coming tonight, and we definitely need this. It's really a good recipe, though, with the rain striking at night like this, so we get to enjoy this day today. Not too bad. Tonight, the rain comes while we slumber. We'll get a nice little break into tomorrow, but still the scattered showers with heavier rain expected again Monday night. There's a uh, shot there, the East Bay shoreline. Not a bad start to the day here. Not much in the way of even fog going on. Temperature check for you, lower 50s over most of the East Bay for now, 53. San Jose. Still chilly 40s, though, up towards the North Bay. Now in Tahoe, they're going to get snow out of this because this is a colder system. If it was coming from the lower latitudes, yeah, we get a lot more rain out of it, sure, and maybe we would talk about flash flooding, but because it's a little colder, we're getting that snow. 38, 32 for Tuesday. By Wednesday, talking about 30. That's when we'll get probably the coldest air over Central California at that point, and then a little recover into the latter portion of the week. So hence, a winter storm warning today through Wednesday. And we're talking footage here for the... Um, Snow resorts and so forth, the ski resorts, they'll probably pick up a couple feet with all of this going on. But there'll also be some winds worth noting when you get to some of those higher elevations. Some of the winds will be hurricane strength with that too for a little time, which we're going to have some breezy conditions here in the home front overnight. So there it comes tonight. This is now into Monday night. Another dose as that low still kind of hangs out there. Can't rule it out still for Wednesday. Then finally starting to depart a little bit, taking a breather for Thursday into Friday. And then another dose into next weekend. This is taking Taking a little bit more of a mid latitude track here, so it might be a little wetter from our perspective. But rain, we definitely need that, and we've got more of it on tap. So we're kind of settled into a little bit of a winter type pattern here with this. Hopefully, this holds, and we're not going to pay for it with a dry January. 60 San Francisco with this uh, for highs today. A lot of 50s at the coast, though, even with a decent amount of sunshine, although it'll be a challenge to clear out the skies along the coast there. You're always fighting that marine layer. 61 for Burlingame, Foster City, 64, 62 for Palo Alto in the South Bay. Lower 60s will do it for the most part. Melpitas at about 60, but even inland, you can see lower 60s, even with decent amount of sunshine at hand, and pretty much universality with all these temperatures working here. 64 for Walnut Creek, 64 Concord, 61 Richmond, 57 chilly degrees Vallejo, Fairfield, you got 63 today, 62 Sonoma, and Santa Rosa about 63. Now, these are actually warmer numbers compared to what's coming our way later. It's in the 50s we're going to struggle through. And Election Day, we'll have about 53 going on here, 57 for Wednesday, taking a dry break here, and then more expected into next weekend. Chilly nights, though, 30s coming our way. Stephanie.